Hey there folks. So today I'm going to show you on this BMW R1250R Roadster what I'm about to do. And I've already gotten started, so I'm sorry I started the video late, but basically I have ordered the Wonderlick um bar risers. And so I'm going to show you how to go through the installation. So I've got my Allen keys and again like I said I already got started. So these are the two these are the two factory original uh bar bar clamps and as you can see right here what i've done is i've gone ahead and, and and taken them off now here these marks i put these marks on here so that i know what the factory exact centering is just to make it easier on me because when you put the bar risers back on this gets covered up but this gives me an idea in case if they slide or if i end up moving them or whatever i can actually position them back in the exact spot so basically what we did so far is all these uh screws right here these are allen's um i basically took my my allen key and and basically loosened those up and so all we're going to do is we're going to take those off now as soon as i did that what ended up happening is the bars you know s slid down so i'm going to have to tighten it put a little bit of tension on it and then reseat them and uh and and then set them up so we'll follow along let me go through the process i need both hands so i'm gonna stop the video okay so as you can see we've gone ahead and put the uh the the longer bolts in that came with the wonderlick piece now one thing i am going to tell you so this has been really painful for me which is i ordered some of these bar risers from amazon and i thought i was going to save my money so i went ahead and ordered 50 60 dollar bar risers they came in what i want to point out in this video is you see how this is built it's not straight up and down it's a little bit you know concave okay so what happens is the ones that came in from amazon they would not fit they they were holding in place but they weren't exactly the the right shape and i just didn't feel comfortable because obviously this is the bar and i'm riding the bike so I went ahead and sent those back, and then I went for the Wonderlick. I was going to get the Wonderlick initially, and I said, oh, well, they're too expensive. I'm just going to get them off of Amazon. Don't make that mistake. Get the ones from Wonderlick because this piece right here is cut exactly. I mean, it fits like a glove. As soon as I tighten it down, this thing's going to be perfect. It'll be factory new. Um, the Amazon ones do not give you that same um, feeling. So just word of caution just get the wonderlick ones okay so as you can see i've got both of the bar risers put on i've got the bolts tightened down and so now i'm going to go ahead and slide the bar on from the bottom and then put the top caps on okay so you guys can see what i've done here is i've put this first one on for the uh, ergonomic bar riser and originally i had my bar sitting over here and once you put this on you can't bring it over it's it's too much of a crest so what i had to end up doing was removing it bring the bar and put it over here uh and gently rest it against the uh the 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 tank and then go ahead and put in this bolt and this bolt which are the two securing bolts to the original bmw um front suspension or bar and then once I put the bar back on, then I'll put the top cap on and put these two, these two bolts. Okay, so as you can see, folks, this is how it looks. This is how they fit on there. Perfect fit. Tightened everything down. The bars are exactly centered. Um, remember, I made those two black marks, which fall right under here. So that helps you center it. So when you originally take everything apart, don't move the bars when you take these caps off take a sharpie and just mark it it makes it so much easier to position it you know left to right and and, and because you're making those marks directly right here it also gives you perfect centering for the up and down angle and then as you sit on the bike and ride it you'll be able to adjust it up and down but this is it basically and i turned it side to side cables are not pulling everything's perfect so we're good to go Hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, and subscribe for me. Thank you so much.